welcome back to another episode of To the Earth Side of the Moon. This is the fourth week. On the first three weeks, I have failed many, many, many times over. Um, finally got some advancements in science at the end of last week's episode, so hopefully this week the goal will be to get a satellite in orbit with solar panels so it can just stay in constant orbit. We'll see if I can pull that off. That's the game plan, as well as possibly pick up some small missions to uh, get some more cash and science. But a little housekeeping before I start. Um, am a little behind on the YouTube feeds. Last week is not up yet. Um, I plan on having both this week's and last week's up by the end of this weekend. And also next week, there will be no stream. I have some things going on, so we'll be taking a break next week. And then the following week, be right back at it. With that, let's get it going. Save to the moon. So, if I remember right, I was like barely off of this. Yeah, I need 90, so I need just a little bit more science is all I need. So, I could probably just run a archive. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot about this. It tells me all this different stuff it's done. On shores, upper atmosphere, launch pad, flying at Kerbin, base high over Kerbin, and base near Kerbin. Uh, aerial study. I need to do that one in flight. Temperature scan, air pressure, launch pad, space near an upper hat. So I can actually go deep with that and get something. Oh wow. So I've gotten a lot of different ones. Okay. Shorts, we're going to try to do one real quick in atmosphere readings. I'll be launching the same thing I did at the end of last week. Hopefully this will have no parts to spare. Of course it doesn't. But I'm not doing this mission anymore, so I will not need these. Meaning that I can... Yeah, a standard parachute. And can put a barometer on this guy. What is this? Experiment storage unit. Okay, we'll go for it. We'll see what I can do real quick with this. It's a quick start, get this science, and once I get the science, we should be in business. So we'll just hurry up. Nothing new with this, same old, same old. Do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. Yeah, after that, the game plan is completely redesigned. This top part would be a lot different. We would have a um, satellite instead of the main crew cab. And then that would allow me to... Make sure my stage is right, sorry about that. That will allow me to then um, put on a rechargeable battery with solar panels. Keep that sucker in orbit. Already 
pretty far. out a little bit get me a little deeper That's definitely deeper than what I've been. So we will fast forward. Get me up there. Nice chilled tunes. Get behind that. Slow it down a little bit when we get close. All right, there. Right there should be close enough. So where's my barometer? Right there. Yeah, that's science. That's what I'm talking about. Now, the fall. No, no, what? I hit play. I hit play and it didn't listen. Are you fucking serious right now? Ah, uh, okay, real quick. You know that's high enough. Ah, frustrating. I was there, I had the science. What well, do? Come on down. I should have had those up to start with. Eh, hold on. Ahead of you there, Predatrix. Landing gears are now up because I'm a dummy and forget to put them up. Get away from those explosions. Half. I'll dial it back. threshold yeah yeah okay so do a little fast forward in here learn my lesson last time I'm not going to fast forward as fast on the way down because yeah that was a jerk move by the game 100% I blame the game okay so Gonna do our little reports here. We got this guy right. Where are you at? Right there. We're gonna log the pressure. We're gonna record it. We'll observe this and it won't give me anything. Now give me it. I'll take it. Close those doors. Give me a crew report. Won't give me anything. Okay. So at this point. So 
was it coming back? Heat it up a little bit. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. Uh, is that what that number is? Yeah, 500. Base center. Base center. Get me in. Closer. I'm gonna land in the ocean. I'm laying on this a little too late, I think. Did I lay on it too late? No, I should be hitting. Oh, I'm still going so fast. Saved it. No, just for good measure. Landing gear in the ocean because, yeah, why not? Okay, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. That's all I needed. I'm gonna get my satellite up. Fast forward a little bit because I'm impatient. Let's see. Sea level should be zero meter touchdown. That should drastically slow me down. Now let's get down. All the way down, please. Slower. And there we go. Go play in the big pool. Okay, be further away next time. That is loud. All right. Cover you. There we go. There's some science. All right. So. Now. Let's do me a satellite, shall we? Electronics. Next up, unmanned control technology. Small unit. Even relay control, but it also provides automatic stabilizing assistance. That's awesome. So there's my autopilot without having a pilot. Solar panels. Rechargeable power bank. Oh, this is everything I need. What's next here? Um, structural stuff. Ooh, relay antenna. Big guy. Back to coupler, and what's this? Advanced electronics. Better stuff. Okay, but. Got what I need, so now I can actually get a satellite up. See if there's anything for mission control. Uh, I don't like site based stuff. No. Actually, I'm not going to do any missions on this one. This one's strictly going to be... All of this goes away. Jeez. Dave Putnick offers ultimate solution for your safety, a lightweight sphere equipped for remote receiving. 
carries no crew at all, thus keeping them perfectly safe from harm. This device does require electronic to operate, however, and will cease to function if its power runs out. Building batteries should keep it going for about 10 minutes. Okay. You. We're going to put that on you. Yeah, so now... We need... Unit. Not what I wanted. That actually doesn't do shit for me, does it? Thought I could open these doors. I was greatly mistaken. Utilities, what I'm looking for. Hey, utility. What is this? Or wide beam, low power eliminator. Ah, huh. lights. Okay. There we go. That's what I'm looking for. Service bay. Open this guy up. We will store us. That's a rechargeable bank right there. Well, hell. See if I can get this in the right order. I do because you fit better that way. There we go. And can I... Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Put you on. Put four of these bad boys on. Yeah. goes yeah aha bad boy should go into nice deep orbit and finally I'll have some progress after this, I'm actually going to relaunch my old one with the crew on there, and I think I might be able to get it to the moon. I do zero science. Man, I am getting a lot of drag off of that damn satellite. So let's control this. Do that way. Start tipping you. Right there. There's the mark. about halfway that should be enough kill the engines creep you up there a little bit a little more just add more Okay. Close enough.
And then we're going to work our way there a little more. Okay, so then turn this off. A little tap. I can get moving. Lock it. Pull up. Pull up. Get a little that way. There we go. Money. Here we go. Finally, did something right. We're going to fast forward to the far side of this. Oh, that's satellite communications, what those little beams mean. I can only communicate when I'm back here. We're gonna see this come back online as I get closer. Okay, okay. So when I get back to the uh, close point, I'll expand back, get the part without reception even further out. Yeah, I like that. I can do that. I can dig it. My speed's going a lot more right there. Okay, yeah, here we go, here we go, here we go. So if I go ahead and stop it about there, get out of the map. Oh, son of a bitch. What did I just do? Oh, I fucked up, I fucked up bad. Oh. So, I'm not sure what this is going to do. We have the moon, and we got the menace. So, let's see where we're going here. I accidentally launched it out of our, or, our um, gravitational force. Well, shit. Oh, at some point it'll come back, I hope. Oh, got a satellite out there. It's a little too far. I'm debris that's not coming back anytime soon. Well, fuck me. Um, I don't know if those parts I had there were extendable or not. But either way, it proved one thing to me, and that's I can make it to the moon for sure. I have no doubt about that. I don't think I'm going to get back. But I can make it to the moon. See what I can do. So, yeah, I'm thinking it's a one way trip to the moon. Hold on, do I need to have people with me?
and one just apparently all of our missions been spring one back to the moon uh. good advance okay we'll do it let's see what we can do I didn't see this having a means to transmit information back, which was a little troubling. So what I will do is make sure I have uh, antenna. to get this one to go by the moon. Why am I not having... I cannot stop this roll. Once I get out of my mains, I'll be able to start angling. Start up my antenna. It's not quite on center. Am I gonna regret putting that thing out there? Aha, I made it. Okay, so we need to definitely pull that that way. Pull you up. Oh, be slow and steady. Start tipping you this way. That right there. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Get this to the 500 meter mark. where it's going to have to be. Okay, here we go. So. Fast forward out. soon this should kind of flip on me and it'll start to expand slow down my throttle pretty right there that's what I'm talking about. What is this? Don't, don't 
hibernate. Fuck hibernation. Am I going to be able to make... Oh, I can. Yeah, sweet. Warning, transmission, interruption, may corrupt it. Okay. So, let's shoot around a few times, shall we? Maybe this time. Oh, shit. That, that was close. Okay, so now is that gonna count for shit? Back into satellite communication. Leave that guy out there. Agency Sean Connor or Canaries. You're out there. You're out there. You're in here. Okay. So, I don't think they'd give that to me. Um, I've never used the modules for. Oh, I got a lot of cash. I think they gave me. I have to, I can't bring it back. <laughs> There's no way I can bring it back. But yes, I am aware of those. Um, actually see about doing a little bit of that. just put that right there. How many pieces am I talking? So I got eight pieces to go. Okay. Because I need one of these. I'm going to need a small engine with a mild amount of fuel. Room. Full 
Okay. But I am heavier, so I won't get as far on my initial. But I also need my landing gears, which would max me out. Utility. Not utility, it's ground. No, I'm not taking science on this one. This one, I'm actually going to see if I can make it. But man, if I land on the dark side, I'm fucked. Man, I just now realized that I have absolutely no light. Hey, my caps lock's on. Landing shots. To try and to land with Eve again. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Is, um, that small engine, because I don't need much to get off the moon. So I'm hoping to have a little bit left in my big engine. Once I get to the moon, I'll help use the big engine to help slow down to fall into its orbit. I'll use that to correct, keep my speed very, very low, get rid of it as soon as I run out of fuel throw my landing gears on and slowly just let my engine take me down. Then hopefully have enough to get back off and get back into Kerbin. Down I'm going to have enough um, engine to help me land in Kerbin, so that's why any science I would have would get shredded, so I'm not even going to try to bring it. Because this is going to be a very direct, hot re-entry. Oh, stability. Yeah. You don't seem to be a big thing for me here. We'll see what we can do. Actually, I'm wondering. <clears throat> There's two ways to go with this. If I tilt towards the 270, I will go head on into the moon. But if I tilt to the 90, I will go into the moon's orbit. Where if I am at any speed difference at all, I will either overtake the moon or the moon will overtake me. I'm thinking going with it might be the best way. That way I can get captured by its gravity. So I'm gonna think I'm think we're gonna try going 90 this time. Um yes, I made sure whenever I put those, I put those as about as low as I could. And that should cover it. Yeah, because it'll be close. As long as I'm not on a hill, my landing gear should cover my engine. But really right now I'm just worried about leaving the fucking atmosphere because this thing looks wobbly. I'll have enough I'll have enough fuel to slow down. I got this. Oh. Oh, so much for my 90. I'm already starting to veer 270. Some bitch, 270 it's gonna be. Really don't want to, actually, you know what? Fuck it. I'm gonna course correct right now. What just. My staging. Man, sometimes I swear. There we go. Okay. Ooh, buddy. Is 
all sorts of fucked up. Back onto the 90. About right where my mouse is. That is all fucked up. I've got to correct that. Man, that is all fucked it up. Remember what purple does. you back on course. Extend out that a little bit more. <sighs> Got fucked by the takeoff. Yeah, this is going to be a one way. If I even fucking make it, this is terrible. Yeah, we're just bringing this one back. I have no fucking chance in hell. See if I'm expanding enough to where Oh man, it's a super fuel efficient fucking engine. This might be what I need to start doing, is getting to the smaller engine. I might be able to get out there. Angle's growing. Other way, other way, other way.
There we go. You know what? We're going to go for it. We're going to see what we can do here. That is super far out, so... See what happens. Yeah, it's just the big ones are so uneconomical. I just need to get out of atmosphere and then rock a small one. Okay, my impatience miss is going to... Cut it. Let's see what happens. Not this time. Should I just realize my satellite might end up hitting my fucking ship here? Or I slow down. I also got to remember it's a lot closer on the screen than what it really is. Oh, shit. Guess who's going to the moon? That. There it is. Man, I don't have shit for um. I'm gonna burn for it because there is no atmosphere, so I can't parachute. A little screenshot here. Getting close. Close, damn it. Alright, so. Want to maintain that nose right on up. Fast forward a little more. Let's get to about 100,000. I'll start thrusting. Maybe I'll do a little now. I oh, know I'm gonna wait a bit closer. Here we hurry up. I don't have oh man, this is not gonna cut it. <laughs> oh yeah. So um Oh shit, did I just do that? I just put myself in orbit around the moon. Let's see. I don't want to be in orbit around the moon. If I release my last stage directly at the moon. Yeah, that's right.
Yep, I'll put the parachute out for no reason, but... And this is the last we've seen of Jebediah. Let's see, what would the crew report get me here? And nice and peaceful. All the way down. Let's get there a little quicker, shall we? What's my speed of impact here? It's not really that fast. I didn't need a whole lot more engine. I could have done that. Game is real pretty. We'll say that. I can't go any faster. Ah, look, he's so happy down there. He has no clue what's about to happen. He's all smiles, la da 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 And Jebediah is gone. Rip. So I did not bring Jebediah back because technically... That should have just accomplished part of my mission. Boo, no it didn't. Jebediah died in vain. Oh, so once it was point of no return, one of two things was gonna happen. I was going to slow it down enough for I'd actually successfully land, or I was just gonna throw the fucker in the moon. I tried to slow down to where I would land, but I actually ended up putting it into orbit because I threw my thrust too soon. So, I kind of want to, yeah, it would have been an impossible rescue mission. The Martian, only the Kerbin edition with the moon. So I'm gonna make a new one here. We're gonna say, Redesign. Of Lander. There. And. Um, actually I need that part right there. There we go. Okay. The rest of that's gone. Okay. That's my landing module right here. I need some fuel for deep space with a smaller engine. Um, we're going to couple that. It's going to be really big and bulky initially with a double here with a big guy. thrust for the quits. Okay. There's that. It puts me at 16. So we're staged properly, right? Yes. My stage. And there's that. Stage. That. And back. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. So now we need some coupling. How many pieces can I afford? I have four. 14. But oh, shit. I f fucking can't do what I want to do here.
Oh my god, every time I do that, I'm... shall go. I really don't like that though. It's gonna be super unstable. Aerodynamics, they make a lot of difference. Two parts. Literally, get two wings. That's it. Man, I hope that works. Let's see what we can do here. It's gonna be all wobbly. Actually, not bad. Let's see what happens on takeoff, though. Well, <laughs> yes, thank you, Chris. My staging is bad. Okay, so um, let's uh, fix that staging, shall we? Um, let's add that and we'll throw you in there. Now we're good. I checked all the other fucking staging. Except for the, that. All right, so now, let's see what we get. Okay, pretty nice, pretty straight. Hold and still, I like it. I like it, we're getting there. You know what? I'm really wondering if this is possibly a little lighter than my old module was. Maybe can start to tilt it a little. Nope. Well, once I disengage this. cooking. Now we're cooking. Here was my points. Okay, so I'm going to hit the 300 mark. At the 300 mark. Oh, fuck, I don't have enough engine to hit the 300 mark. Yeah, I do. 250 is enough. We're gonna stall out this engine. Actually, I can just give it a little tap there so I can move this down. Get it prepped. There. And now, you're going to fast forward a little bit. Get on up there. Get on up. Get on down. Get on up. All right, hey, lonely dudes, going back to Earth to blow up. Actually, it looks like burn up. Yep, burn up. Okay, so right about there. Okay, low burn. Get in position. Check your shit. See if we can launch it in orbit. Ah, fuck me. Trying to 
trying to play a little catch up right now at the same time too, which isn't good. I should have went a little ahead of time. Wait a little too much. My speed's not great, but with these little engines, the speed doesn't need to be great. I just need to be patient. I should be here shortly. About a third burn. I'm trying to do two different things at once here. Not doing either particularly well. There we go. There we go. Then this sucker. Man, I took a bad take off, damn it. That's really gonna kill me. I did not take off, but I started that too late. Stage might be able to get me orbit. It's gonna be close. Oh, buddy. Oh, fuck you. And orbit. Okay. Now it's gonna flip. Now this number is gonna climb like crazy. Gonna play the game just like I did last time. There we go. There we go. past there okay now let's do the dance the moon there come on back Ooh, this one could be a good one this one could be good So, what I need to do, position away from it. Why am I not? That, that's not doing what I wanted to do. Do I need to actually go at you? Ahead of you, rather. Actually, what am I worried about? Right now, this is a direct fucking path to the moon. I'm just being stupid. That was a waste of fuel. Okay. Get nice and close so I don't do this too fast, but I do want to move up a little quicker. So slow. So slow. So fucking slow.
lot closer than I did last time, because last time I royally fucked this up. There was a time I would try to get into orbit and then come out of orbit onto it, because it's just a little easier. But... Okay, it's gonna be the last shot of the night. meters is when I'll kick it again. fuel I need to get closer before I really burn. 10,000 point, I'll really lay on to it. 10,000 be too late. Do it now. Ah, oh, fuck, man. I don't have enough fuel. This is gonna suck. Sign a first explosion. I'm gonna try to um, disengage the uh, command module. Did not work. It was close. It was close. Um, I feel I wasted a lot of fuel getting close. I shouldn't have been doing it like that. But, lesson learned. Got two satellites up into orbit. Actually hit the moon twice, so finally getting progress. I just need to actually um, get this going a little bit better next time. So, that said, that's going to probably wrap up all we got for it this week. Just a reminder, once again, next week will not be running. Um, I've got some stuff coming up, but the week after we'll be back and we are going to land on the damn moon next week. Guarantee that shit. But anyway, um, if you need caught up, you can always go to our YouTube channel, 72 Pin Connector. Um, like I said, this weekend I'll have this week's episode and last week's updated as well as... Um, a few of the lost and founds for the last few weeks. I had Ninja Gaiden last week. Tom's got Ballistic this week. But either way, that's all I got for you guys this week. So until next week, game on. <laughs>